everyone, I'm Alicia Anderson and welcome to The Fort Report. Keeping with the theme of our subject this week, I'm going to show you how to fold some paper airplanes. Now it's been a while and I'm doing this by memory, so please bear with me. All right, I call this one the butterfly. Huh? I can do better. Okay, this one I call the magic carpet. Ooh. Okay, one last try. Okay. Uh, I call this one the I give up. Oh, that actually went really far. I think initially what I looked at the, in terms of a design aspect, what would fill up the space. A couple of things I found interesting. One, I just love these sort of open spaces. It's sort of a whimsical play area for me. And once you get to a balcony and look down, there's always sort of a, there's an urge, sort of a natural urge to like, you know, throw something down or see some sort of create, some sort of dialogue between, you know, different levels of things like that. Um, but the other thing that I found really interesting was the transition of the airport from sort of being a main commercial hub to sort of being this mixed use of of, of different types of office buildings, schools, things like that. So um, between those two things, sort of the idea of the paper plane sort of came about because it's not only just the idea of aviation, but it's sort of this idea of school and planes and paperwork and things like that in offices. Public artwork at Meacham International Airport consists of 800 paper airplanes. It's stainless steel, water jet cut, um, bent form stainless steel, um, with powder coating on top and the threads that it's being tied to are actually stainless steel like 0 0.012 so it's like stainless steel thread almost. I think it's important to have different layers in these projects that you can sort of discover as time goes by and if you don't get to all of them fine but to have you know have enough in there that it you know becomes something that can continue to to be discovered along the way. Visit Meacham International Airport to view the artwork. I finally remembered how to fold these things! See? For a listing of more events and city meetings, you always can check the calendar at the city's website.